Hello everyone and welcome back to another Create a Sim makeover video. Today we will be giving a makeover to Princess Kimberly and for Kimmy. So I would say that this is a Sulati. Uh, at first I was gonna say it's like her Sulani makeover because well currently in the Royal Family series we are on season two episode 71. So that just happened. So next episode will be season two episode 72. So Kimmy Makana did just get married a couple episodes ago so now she will be in Sulani however I did keep well first of all I wanted to keep some of her um, Oasis Springs outfits as well but I also gave her a few new Oasis Springs outfits I believe um, and then I also gave her not necessarily pertaining to any of the kingdoms but just some like of her glamour outfits, like some of, we'll say like Aisha's designs. Um, and then of course, some new outfits for Sulani, a couple traditional Sulani outfits, and then also just like beach outfits because she will, she's living at the beach. So there's that too. And then I believe I gave her a new top portion to her mermaid tail. So the, the mermaid look, but I'm really excited for this. I do have an announcement. I was supposed to announce this in the last episode, but I forgot, but you guys will be the first to hear. Kimmy is pregnant. So her and Makata will be having a baby in a couple episodes and I am very, very excited. And for the baby, I'm so it's definitely not gonna be in the next episode. I wanna say the one after that. Um, I do try to space out a couple episodes before they have their babies. However, because we're currently telling Alice May's story in the series right now. And this is like one of the first times I've gotten like, People have been asking about their ages, mostly for like Alice May and the teens and the characters in her story. But then people were asking about the ages for the other Sims as well. So I will say that like the, like when they have their babies, like the other characters, that doesn't necessarily line up with the timeline of Alice May's story, if that makes sense. So um, everyone else is on a different timeline than Alice May because this episode, the last episode and this coming episode, technically for her story takes place like within, it's the same night and then like within a day of each other. So it's not all gonna add up. So I just wanna say that because people were trying to like compare the ages. So if it gets too complicated, we don't have to go into detail with that, but I, I just wanted to say that. Um, so hopefully that's not too confusing, but I typically like, since people do like to know the ages, then I'll adjust things in the future, but it's The Sims, it's very hard. Well, I know you can adjust the timeline of like how long until they have their baby, but people always really want to see the babies very soon, which I totally understand. I'm very excited to see their baby too. So them being pregnant for three days is not realistic. Anyway, okay. I feel like Kimmy is just very iconic and the whole group itself, the whole teen group was very iconic as well. And it's so weird seeing them grow up and seeing them as teens and all the drama that had happened with them at the parties and stuff. And now they're having children, they're getting married. We pretty much just finished our wedding season. We have one or two weddings left in the future, but they were like one of the last ones. They were the last big royal wedding that we did. And now they're having a baby and I'm very excited. I think they're going to be great parents. I do feel like Makan is very nervous and like wasn't quite prepared, but I think like once they have the baby, the dad instincts will kind of kick in for him, but they're both very laid back. Kimmy herself is just very nurturing, just so like kind and sweet. And I just feel like she's going to be such a great mom. Also, if you guys have baby name suggestions, you are welcome to drop those in the comments below as well. I actually don't have a name picked out for them at all. So you guys are welcome to. Uh, definitely, we want to go with uh, Hawaiian names, Polynesian names, uh, Samoan names. Uh, so anything you guys have and want to drop below, if you know the meaning and you want to say that as well, you can do that. Speaking of Hawaiian names, for Kimmy, she's, she's the first one I'm really doing this with, but I was thinking that when Makana does become king, that Kimmy would go by, like the people would know her by Queen Kimmy Pelly, which is Kimberly, it's Kimberly translated into Hawaiian, which doesn't necessarily mean anything specific, but Kimmy, so the first part of that, that means royal fortress in Hawaiian. So I thought that was interesting, but altogether Kimmy Pelly doesn't, 
like together doesn't necessarily mean anything, but just to show like that, like we'll still call her Kimmy and I'll still spell it uh, K-I-M-M-Y, but just, I wanted to try this. I wasn't sure if I was going to do this. We didn't give Dean a Hawaiian name. I, I think we had thought about it, but I didn't feel like it, it, I don't know. I didn't feel like it fit at the time. I don't think we could find anything that was like similar enough as well. So I think that's why I was kind of like, mm, I'm not sure about this, but I want to try it with Kimmy. Again, she'll still, we'll still go by Kimmy, but if we're doing like big announcements, like when they announce King Makana and Queen Kimmy Pelly, so they'll do that for like their people. But I really like the outfits we picked for her. There was definitely a few that I end up changing later on that you guys will see. There's some that she used to have like a while ago that I brought back as well, like some favorites of mine, but I love her. Kimmy's gorgeous. She's so unique looking. She has so much of Philip in her. She has so much of her dad in her. And I just like, I see him a lot when I look at her, which makes me really sad because Philip was one of my favorites. But yeah, I'm so excited for her and Makana. They will be living at the main Sulani Palace still. So Kimmy has moved in there. And well, I mean, Leilana probably still has a lot, a lot of life left in her. For some reason, the women in Sulani live for like a very, very long time. I'm assuming it's because they have such a high fitness skill from being mermaids. That's what everyone was saying. So, I mean, Makana's, Makana Samaria and Kaleo's grandmother, Lokalani, she's still alive. And I actually did extend the elder stage a bit because what, like if I was trying to do the math, I was like, when they die, they're like, late 60s, 70s, like I feel like that's too early. So technically I, I think that her grandmother is like in her 70s, or sorry, not Kimmy's grandmother, Makana's grandmother, Lokalani, is in her 70s right now. But yeah, she's still got a lot of life left in her. And then of course Leilana probably has a lot too. So we'll see, we'll see when, if they ever become king and queen. If it ends up passing over him, that would be interesting too. I honestly don't have like a specific plan. I'm just willing to kind of go with things. But yeah, so that is everything here. You guys can find my custom content on my Pinterest board, which is linked below. I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you enjoyed seeing Kimmy and her new outfits. Don't forget to hit that like button and hit that subscribe button if you have not already. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.